The Leechwell Garden is a small community garden in the heart of Totnes. Totnes is very short of public open space, so this provides a much needed additional public open space. And I think it's probably the first for hundreds of years that's been created in Totnes. It's a community garden because it came about through a community movement. There was a plan to develop the southern area of the town, which we're standing in the middle of, and a lot of people stood up and said, no, we don't want the whole thing developed. Why can't that become a public open space? And so the community campaigned to have the plans change successfully. Almost 90% of the money that we received from community spaces was spent on four major pieces in the garden. There's the play structure here, there is a large post and beam pergola made out in the traditional way from oak on the far side. There are some beautifully crafted oak benches in the herb garden and then a local blacksmith made the one-off gates and the, the name over the gates which lead you into the Leechwell garden. The play structure here was created around this big tree trunk and this tree trunk didn't need to be imported onto the site because it's the result of a big eucalyptus tree being felled when the garden was first being created. Earthrights, who were the contractors who produced this play structure, used the fallen tree trunk as the basis for the, for the play. It didn't come from a catalogue, it was made by an individual or an individual company specifically for the garden. Leechwell Garden Association, South Hams and ourselves knew from the beginning that we wanted to integrate art into the garden. So as designers we bore that in mind as we drew up the community's ideas. So there are uh, lots of different types of art in the garden. There's the functional types, the gates, the benches, um, the pergola that I'm standing beneath. There's the performance, there's the spaces where poetry, music, plays can happen. Low-born land mollusk, high-impact intruder, easy oozer, slime exuder. Slug, when all is said and done, you can hide, but you can't run. We've really worked hard to integrate the art into the garden, so that the whole garden becomes a piece of art full of different types. It's not a garden with a statue in it. We've gone way beyond that now. There are lots of artists in Totnes. It's a missed opportunity if we don't help them and use them to make our town a more enjoyable space. We had a competition. We had £5,000. Uh, we opened the competition to um, artists living in South Devon and we had a terrific response. We asked the four finalists to present themselves for an exhibition for the public for one day in Totnes so they could come in and write down their comments and they did. They wrote pages of comments. In the end, I think the public overwhelmingly liked the idea of Rosie Musgrove's stone sculpture, Three Guardians for the Garden and that's the conclusion that the judges came to as well. So we were all very happy to see her as the winner and we're looking forward to seeing the, the work unveiled on Sunday. It's been an absolute privilege to carve these three guardians for this magic garden, and it is a magic garden. It's been just lovely for me. And I would like to thank some people who have really helped to make this project happen and that's South Hams District Council and the Leechwell Garden Committee. I wanted to submit an idea that was very much based on the medieval springs because I've known this piece of land for a long time. I knew that the water from the springs ran through the garden and it felt really important to have the rhythm of the water as well as to do some very simple carvings of the toad and the snake and the long crippler so that people would think, ah yes, of course, there are medieval springs behind here. This is an ancient piece of ground and the water flows through the garden. 
I was really anxious about the installation because we had to get the columns from the moor and bring them down here. As soon as all the guys got involved, I realised, hey, why was I anxious? You know, they were all so efficient and so helpful. I have one it is, it's a magic garden. I think it's a magic garden. And it brings cooperation, and long may it continue to do so.